If you thought this story was going anywhere, think again. Just 25 hours removed from Judge Catherine Fela's decision to deny Cowboys running back Ezekiel Elliott a preliminary injunction, the case has already moved to the Second Circuit Court of Appeals, where Elliott's team is throwing up a Hail Mary, hoping to again put the suspension on hold. Meanwhile, Cowboys owner Jerry Jones continues to defend his running back and takes shots at NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell. Sure, he'd like to take back his initial Ray Rice stance and a few others, and he's in the process of having tried to correct that, and in doing so, Zeke is a, a victim of an overcorrection. As Elliott, his legal team, and Jones continue to battle this out in the courts, both legal and public opinion, Elliott's teammates have no choice but to prepare for life without him. Zeke is, you know what I'm saying, the head honcho in our room right now, but... um. Like I said, uh, it ain't gonna be it ain't gonna be no slowing down. We we gonna keep going. Running backs Alfred Morris, Darren McFadden, and Rod Smith, in that order, will be the insurance policy in Elliott's absence. All the confidence in the world. I mean, these guys have run for a bunch of yards in this league, and they've run with us too. So, um, you know, they're great backs, and we're looking forward to seeing them play. Importantly, the Cowboys' offensive line has gotten rolling in recent weeks, which could set up this backfield committee to be effective. The chemistry, you can see the chemistry there with the offensive line and running backs and. Receivers, you can just see the chemistry starting to flow. Chemistry, and it sounds like confidence too. I think slowing them down, just go out there and just keep the ball rolling. Don't have the seat hot and ready for him when he get back. Mike Leslie, Channel 8 Sports, The Star.